My name is Philippe Daverio, and I'm sort of an unplanned mixture and cross between France, Germany, and Italy, with a deep curiosity for English peculiar moods and habits, and a real passion for Hispanic fantasies. The only way I found to mix up all those matters was to write a book. The Ideal Museum, a travel through art history from the end of the 13th century up to today. It is like playing with art history and architecture. I decided to invent the museum as a building where the collection has to be shown and where the paintings follow not the concept of history but the agreement of the different spaces in which you are going to see them, from the library to the bedrooms and to the dining room. And that brings to very normal anthropological connections between the works of art. The oldest paintings shown are the Arnolfinis, and the nearest to us is Francis Bacon. The book was published last year by Rizzoli in Italy and had a wonderful success. It sold over 80,000 copies, and it is presently translated in English. I am full professor at the University of Palermo in architecture, and I'm giving lectures at the Politecnico in Milan. But I'm also working for the Italian national television since 10 years with a program on art history and anthropology, which seems to have a wonderful success. With about three million people watching it. Because the funnest way, in order to understand where we are coming from and where we are going, stays in the discovery of art history. There's nothing faster to understand mankind than watching in a curious way a good painting.